hey guys welcome to my channel um this is made for love and this is your daily twin transmission let's see what the energies are like today with our dm and dfs so this is the energy of your twin so whether you're dm or df this is for you you know it's a mini update so we gotta keep it brief And the overall energy is all about this man holding this coin, this person being abundant. So both parties feeling more abundant today than yesterday and recognizing that the divine is in control because this is this is a 43, it um, boils down to 7 and they're reflecting on this divine path that they have traveled. You see the purple in the back? So it might be purple ray people we're talking about. Um, this divine part that they've traveled to arrive at this moment where they are fully in their power, they are confident, and they are ready to share this life with someone else. They've gotten wisdom. You see the gray hair? They've gotten wisdom. They feel abundant. And now it's looking into the future. Who do I share this with? That's the energy both parties are bringing. All right, let's go, guys. So DF, DM, connected with energy. Usually I just take one card, but you know, yesterday about well, three cards came out. So we need guide it. Whatever happens, happens. Alright, so it looks like today each twin gets two cards. That seems to be what's going on. So that was the F. Let's see what's happening with the M. One more card for the M, please. And of course you can switch it up, right? Whichever side resonates for you and then the other side will be a twin. I'm going to take it on that. And then let's have one card for the connective energy. So on the F side, Ooh, blocked energy today. Why? 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 Okay. All right. Let's see what's going on with the F. Okay. What's going on with the F? We have the card number 11, Cornucopia, and then we have another 7 card. So 7 might be quite significant because our first card out was 7, and it says, Door to Personal Healing and Happiness. Mm -hmm. DF, what's going on with you? You know, it's like DF is swinging back and forth. You know, when I started this um, daily twin transmission, um... That was well two nights ago. She had blocked energy with feeling abundant. Then yesterday, she was queen, feeling quite abundant and really focused on herself. And today, um, it's back to no more blocked energy again. Dear, what's happening? So it seems like DF has had a little wobble. It seems like DF has had a little wobble. And you know, there's strong um, energies happening at this time. I think um, Jupiter's a retrograde. And um, my friend and I, Charlotte, were just talking about this this, this morning. And she was saying that we, we she was saying that she was conversing with another friend of ours. 
and Jupiter retrograde is supposed to be even stronger than Mercury retrograde in terms of these kinds of energies. So maybe she's feeling that. But something has happened to make Dia feel less abundant than she usually feels and less happy than she usually feels and may have even had a may have even made a kind of halt in her healing. So something has happened that has triggered um, DF. And of course, I'm, so, I'm sure it's something that the DM did. <laughs> you know, but something has happened. So she's not feeling that abundance. She's not feeling um, this treasure chest. She's not feeling... Um, She's not listening to her intuition. Maybe she's allowing the things that are happening in the 3D to really give her a little um, world there, a little trigger. So maybe there might, there might have been something that happened in the 3D that really kind of set her off her path for a moment. Because I do believe it's just this is just temporary. Because she's been vacillating back and forth um, since I started these readings. One minute feeling abundant, next minute feeling not. And... And she's and that's also been mirrored by um, the DM as well, you know. So it's a, there's a lot of mirroring happening, happening, a lot of flip flopping. But you know, it's it's just really temporary at this point in time. All right. So DF not feeling as confident as she usually does, and she may have even had a little hiccup with her healing and not feeling as happy as she thinks she would be would be feeling at this point in time. I think also she might be feeling a little bit frustrated. She may think that, you know, she should be further along with her healing um, at this point in time, or this union should be further along. But, you know, it's just been a long, tough road. So today, having a bit of a moment, and, and that's all right. <laughs> that's all right. You're human. You're having a human experience. It's fine. So a bit of blocked energy here on the DF side. DM is doing a little better. DM, I think, yeah, DM. We got this card yesterday for these twins. Um, DM is really um activating his crown chakra. He's really getting a lot of downloads about um this journey about who DF means to him and about his path, his spiritual path, because I'm really looking at this, um, a lot of purple here and the wings. So he's been spiritually guiding at this point in time. He's been div divinely guided and a lot of downloads coming through his crown. Um, it says seven chakra archangel Uriel. So this is the, the, the archangel that's working with him at this point in time. And really giving him a lot of downloads. And this call is causing a lot of shifts. Because this is a 41. That reduces to 5. So it's been causing a lot of shifts. Um, you're going to see a lot of movement from DF or actually. From DM, sorry. Maybe from DF too. A lot of movement from DM because he is getting these downloads. About his mission. About his life. The path that he has to take. And it says here adjacent possibilities now this might be a little triggering card right um he may be exploring his options at this point in time in terms of other people it's quite possible but um i'm really seeing here exploring his options in terms of ways to um, make himself abundant because for the dm being abundant in the material world is incredibly important for his self-esteem and his self-confidence and building that self-confidence to a level where he feels he's it's safe enough to approach the F. So what he's doing right now is really um, focusing on other possibilities for wealth generation, focusing on alternative teachings in terms of his um, spiritual path, really looking at those options. And it and it it could be you know exploring other possibilities. Um, if he's in a karmic relationship, thinking about things outside of the karmic relationship and what life could be like. I see it like a broken door here, or a broken window. Something that's falling off his 
it's hinge it's hinges it's like he's breaking free from traditional paradigms for traditional ideologies that stuck place that he was in he's breaking free completely and he's really thinking outside of the box he really is okay and the collective energy between these guys strategy in reverse oh what i'm getting from this and as soon as this card popped out i'm getting that this is an end to the mind games this is an end to signals an end to manipulation this signals um an end to control issues trying to control this this what's happening here trying to map out every single move trying to predict what the other person is going to do i think they've both released all of that and realize you know what i just have to let the divine do their work i can't do it it's not within my control it's not for me to control this journey and this situation anymore just let it go so to me it's an end it's, it's an end to the mind you've entered manipulation into the control issues and just allowing the divine to do whatever they have to do. And I see the three and immediately I think DMDF and the divine, that, that trinity. So this is an end to control issues. Whatever happens, happens. It's all in divine's hands. And I think that's the connective energy um, between them today. So, DF, feeling a little blocked today. She might have been triggered by something that DM did. Uh, maybe something she saw on social media or um, something. Something triggered DF today. Something triggered her today. DM, doing a little better. Exploring options in terms of wealth generation and, and his divinity. And getting a lot of downloads um, from spirit. And for both parties, they're just releasing this issue, really detaching, really letting go of control issues and allowing the divine to work um, in this relationship. Okay, so guys, that was your daily twin transmission. I thought it was good. I mean, anytime you let go and allow spirit to do their work, it's a good day. Okay. All right, guys. So I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.